A Mount Hope family loses a 12-year-old boy and everything they own when a fire ripped through their home. And just a few hours ago, the community surprised the family with dozens of gifts. This afternoon, I was the only reporter there for that touching moment. Three children were in the home when a furnace caught fire, burning down the home. Firefighters rescued the three-year-old girl and a five-year-old boy, but it was too late for 12-year-old Fernando Castro, who was autistic. The surviving children are recovering at UCSD. The NPLOA, the National Latino Police Officers Association, wanted to help them, so they organized a toy drive. The SDPD officers set up hundreds of dollars worth of gifts on the hood of a patrol car outside the hospital. Among the gifts, a bicycle, books, and a Star Wars toy. Then they brought out the mother for the big reveal. Juanita Vasquez was overwhelmed. Oh, they're going to be very excited, you know, even though they're going to be there quite a while. But I know when when they open their eyes and see all these things waiting for them, they just they'll be so happy. Yes, they will. Sergeant Ruben Gutierrez is the incoming president of the NLPOA. He said he felt compelled to rally his fellow officers to help the Vasquez family. Several of them from the department and the juvenile services team came together to support them. If we can do anything today, um, that's just to put a smile on the family's face, even for a short moment. Uh, that's going to make our day. I hope that's going to make their day. And so making this especially tough is that this weekend they are going to lay the little boy Fernando to rest.